Few tales are told of Hades, whose very name inspires fear and penitence, reminding us of the inevitable fate which we all share. I, however, mean to tell you such a tale. Listen carefully. Goodbye, Father. To hell with this place. I'm leaving. Try and stop me. Heads up. She is. It's got to be her. Then here goes nothing. <clears throat> In the name of Hades, Olympus, I accept this message. Hail, noble cousin. Now, let's get you from that miserable place. I'll see that all of us upon Olympus do our part, beginning here with me. You can't hear me all the way where you are, goddess, but thank you. I'm hurt. Can't heal myself, but I can fight. Louts! Mm -hmm.
damn it. I'm home. <clears throat> yes. What? Ah, what? <laughs> Welcome to the House of Hades, where... Wait, I know you. Guess that means you died out there, huh? Well, don't be sad, though. Pretty much everybody dies sometime. Some of us more than others. Back already. <laughs> Stupid boy. I told you nobody gets out of here, whether alive or dead. Though how is your wanton ransacking of my domain? Greetings, father. My ransacking was a delight, thank you for asking. So I'll just be on my way again. Be on your way indeed. What do I care? You shall never reach the surface. Go, see for yourself. You have come home. Do not despair, child. Such setbacks are inevitable and may be overcome with effort and with time. You made contact with the goddess Athena. She shall be true to her word. I believe it, Nex. I'm grateful that you put us into contact. I know you took a considerable risk in reaching out. The risk is not to me. I expected the Olympians would involve themselves in this eventually. Reveal to them no more than they already know. Are we understood? Yes, we are. Then go. Hey, room. I'm back. Night and darkness guide me. Ready, I think. The bedchambers of Prince Zagreus lie in a perpetual state of utter disarray, despite his lord and master of the house repeatedly insisting that he pick everything up. Oh, come on, it's not that bad, is it? Okay. I can escape through that pink window there. Can't open this yet. I can do this. First get past the wretched shades of Tartarus. Easier said than done. And doubtless I'll be running into Meg. The River of Flame ought to be just beyond. Find a way up to Elysium from there, and after that, I'll figure something out. No turning back. Thunder. Is that... Is this really him? Okay. In the name of Hades, Olympus, I accept this message. Greetings there, young man. Look, your father's always been rather difficult, and he's not so much as called in quite some time. You'll have a better home where you belong, here on Olympus. And to help you on your journey, have my blessing. Uncle Zeus lending his support. Never thought I'd see the day, or night, whenever.
Composed of such innumerable, ever-shifting, interlocking chambers, the underworld of Lord Hades all but guarantees the dead shall there remain until the end of time. Good thing I'm not dead. Louts. something back home. Each exit has its own reward. Number two, it's got to be. Then, in the name of Hades, Olympus, I accept this message. Oi there, little Hades. You recognize your uncle, do you not? We have a lot of catching up to do, but first things first, you get yourself out of that dour underworld. As for me, I'll see if I can stir things up a bit to cover your advance. Big one. The power of the sea should be of help. They got me. No way to patch up. Got to keep going. heavenly archer I know of. Well, several, really. Anyway, in, in the name of Hades, Olympus, I accept this message. I heard about you. Look, I'm not like all the others on Olympus. The power of the hunt helps keep me company, so maybe it'll help you too. Sounds like good company to keep. Which way? Don't think I've gone this far. They're armored.
underworld's power. Skeletons. Whoa. Whoa, you just got killed by one of those bloodless Inferno Bomber skeleton type guys. Nice. I always wondered what would happen if you just kind of sit around while all their bombs went off. Okay. Someone's at the desk next to the throne. Some sort of special offer for me, my good shade. Who's that sniveling shade to your immediate left there, father? Already found someone new to do the busy work, and here I thought I was utterly indispensable. That shade, boy, is my newly designated contractor. One whose responsibility is to work on this house. Though who shall pay for everything my subjects here demand, I do not know. You're trying to guilt me into funding the exorbitant furnishings you desire. Perhaps once we are finished with repairs for all the carnage you have sown throughout my realm, then we might finally have time for all the needed renovations that have piled up. Nice. You've returned. Good to see you, lad. Despite the circumstances, remember your training out there. The pain of death is but another obstacle. And fear is for the weak. Take care, Achilles. The House of Hades. That dark and lavishly appointed lair of the Underworld's king is home not just to him, but to his willful progeny. You know I can hear you, old man. How goes it, Shanes? was a small lounging area within the House of Hades, now is sealed off in utter shambles since the multi-headed Cerberus tore the space apart, warning the missing prince. A setback, then. Darkness guides you, child. You have outgrown this house. Of that I am now certain. Should you return again here, I shall keep you safe. I won't forget you, Nyx, I swear it. Seeker. Let's deal some death. Psst, over here. What the? Didn't hurt.
Nice place you got here, boyo. Name's Skelly, how's it going? But enough with the small talk already. I'm here to do a job. So let me have it. Give me everything you got. I don't remember having you on payroll, mate. Who's your supervisor? Oh, I'm not about to wrap my sources, pal. Just try and beat it out of me. If you insist. Stygius, Blade of the Underworld. I need your strength. This has to be good. in one piece. Ready. That looks like a Daedalus hammer. Enchantments for my weapon. Daedalus, wherever you may be right now, thank you. first. Dead. Shiny.
of nectar. Who should I give this to? Ah, oh, what I wouldn't give for, say, a healing flask of some sort. Uncle Poseidon, it's been excellent to know you, sir, so please, this is for you. Oh, I am positively moved by your affection, little nephew. Though I think I've just the thing for you in turn. Here, I shall transfer it to you. I thank you, Uncle. Seems to me that you're in dire straits there, little Hades. Why, you're bleeding everywhere. Here, let me try and do something for that. The power of the sea. I hear the river. Kieran's mm. shop. Good. Why, good to see you, Kieran, mate. Just minding my own business, taking in the sights, and I'm sure is awfully convenient to be running into you like this. I had all this coin I wanted to get rid of. The infernal wares of the Stygian boatman Charon lie sprawled about. Available for sale, Doomever would be willing to quench the boatman's great thirst for riches. That would be me. Numbskulls. They absorbed my blow.
up here. this far. Can't escape. Brimstones. of these upon Olympus. Let's see what's in here. I'll take this one. Again? <laughs> hey, you got turned to ashes by those floating brimstone crystally type things. Next time one's turning you to charcoal with those beams of theirs, how about you step on over to the side? That's not a bad idea. Work authorized. A fountain chamber in the depths of Tartarus sounds like an excellent idea. Father, what happened to the lounge? The only place for anyone to have a little fun around here and you seal it shut. Oh, I had little choice about that boy. You see, after you fled the first time, Cerberus, why, he was very much upset. Utterly tore the place to shreds. It's now under repair. All thanks to you. You're really blaming me for not minding the dog while I was out and while you all were here. I lay the blame entirely upon you, yes. Who else? 
It's fortunate that Cerberus has calmed himself since then. Come to his senses, I should say. May you yet come to yours. Hail, Prince. Achilles, is it really true that Cerberus ripped the lounge up right after I left? He must have gotten in a lot of trouble. I only wish you could have seen it, lad. The place looked like a vineyard after a typhoon. Your Lord Father was livid, but he never gets so angry with the dog. Poor Dusa, though, she's picking the place up. Oh no. I wonder what became of Dusa. She's always worried Father's going to fire her, even without something like this. There's a good boy. Cerberus merely feigns concern for you. <laughs> Infernal watchdog Cerberus regards the underworld prince with mixed emotions, from purest joy to deepest melancholy. You watch over things for me, won't you, boy? You know I'd take you if I could. You have returned. Let us communicate again some other time. even tired, thanks. Skelly? Looking good. Nice one. I need more chthonic keys for this. Stygious hungers. to the terrifying sprawl that lies beyond. It's not that orderly, really. Time to go. Time to tune up this sword. lighter than before. That's what you get. Each time the prince delves back into the underworld, its ever-shifting chambers realign to frustrate his attempts to perhaps map it out. Built to ensure no one gets out. We'll see about that.
This can unlock a weapon back at home. Let's see here. Hi there. In the name of Hades, Olympus, I accept this message. Why, hello, hello there, little godling. I have to say, you're quite the specimen, and so I've decided I shall aid you for the moment. You interested? and the power to break hearts. Sure, I don't see why not.
that's what you get. Hey, you're not alone. You're not alone down there, okay? Here, let me show you. My senses sharpen. a couple coins. Oh no. All right, wretches, get to work. Father. Ah, I'm up. Looks like one of the wretched witches shot you dead last time. Sorry to hear that, huh? Have you tried shooting them first? I haven't. Shades of the dead mill constantly within the house, complaining of their woes and seeking audience from any who would listen. I listen. <laughs> Such a shame. I see you've decided to come home. Changed your mind yet? Or looking for more pain and suffering? More pain and suffering for sure. After all, you taught me to appreciate the finer things. You keep telling yourself that, boy. But mark you my words. Sooner or later, this life that you have chosen for yourself shall teach you I was right. Good talk. Good talk. Here, boy. Just as long as one of your three heads enjoys these pets. You really ripped the lounge to pieces, boy? I hope you didn't get yourself in too much trouble. I'm sorry to have worried you like that. The guilt-racked monster Cerberus admits to committing the crime expressing some remorse for having implicated the incendiary prince. Cheer up, boy. It'll be all right. You'll get the hang of it out there, lad. For all our sparring practice, there's no teacher like the real thing. Now then, I have something for you. What, wait, you're giving me your codex? I can't accept something like this. Please, I insist. I want your love of history to grow, not just your love of warfare. Besides, maybe you can finish out the rest of it. I'm grateful. went. Appreciate your patience. I 
I feel different. How's it going? Let's go, Koronok. Find Air or whenever to get me out of here. Bye, everyone. There we go. I have to tell you something, little Hades. My relatives and I, we've been holding back one of our greatest gifts to see if you were worthy. And you are. My aid is yours. So call me if you need anything, especially to smash your enemies to bits. Oh, what's this? Wrath of Poseidon at my beck and call. done. Thank <laughs> you. 
We can use this to unlock a weapon. There. The one called Nyx. She is your mother, as I understand. We Olympians rarely consort with the Chthonic gods, though Nyx herself reached out to me about your plight, and I was spurred to act. Appreciate the backup. Witches. Zeus, um, Uncle, please accept this offering and all my gratitude. Goodness, nephew, that's an offering indeed. I'm thankful for your piety to me. 
And as a show of generosity to you, in turn, I present this. My thanks, Lord Uncle Zeus. No, no one likes to die, young man. But since you seem about to any moment now, you keep your head held high, do you hear me? Electric. Still alive. You lads again, huh? Stupid skeleton twins. Hypnos must be on break. Oh, it's only you. Why, I can scarce believe my eyes. Is that you, boy? Cerberus, look who it is. He's back. <laughs> Cerberus looks mournfully toward the prince. No need to drag the dog into this, father. Anything you say to me, you say in front of Cerberus. You might even learn a thing or two from him of listening and of obedience. If I don't pet your other heads, don't bite my arm off, deal? Permit the dog his rest. How you holding up, boy? Eating well lately? All three mouths full and happy. Each terrifying maw of the infernal watchdog Cerberus responds affirmatively, one after the next, as if to reassure the ever doubting prince. Have you ever run across the Shade of Daedalus in all your time? I found some of his legendary hammers out there, but no sign of him. I've never met him, no. Your father keeps him fully occupied with building out his underworld and renovating constantly. No wonder some of his old crafting tools are strewn about. I take it you've been able to make use of them? Indeed I have. lately from the goddess Athena, Nyx. She seems to admire you. I thought Olympians didn't like our kind. They typically do not. But you are family, child. And I, why, I believed Athena wise enough to understand why someone such as I would seek her in particular. She has in turn made others in her family aware. You make a good team. Open up. Varatha, the eternal spear. Join my pursuit. Anything good? Yeah. 
got something new to try. Which to choose? You're getting pretty strong, I'll give you that, boyo. Strong enough to smack a guy like me right up against the wall and I'd go straight to pieces. Boom! You just remember, when you're duking it out, the walls are your friend. Smack guys against walls. Sound advice as ever, mate. All right, one more time. My brothers Hades and Poseidon once fought bravely by my side. You know that, don't you, nephew? We prevailed against the Titans and established law upon the Earth. Your father then descended to the land of death. And we've not seen much of each other since. Stones. Colorful. Should fetch me something. Time to fight. finished.
out to eat. Zesty. at my style. Should work. Someday I'll go even farther 